Death's Door Distillery is up and running and will open its doors to the public for their grand opening this Monday. And here to tell us a little bit about it is President Brian Ellison. Good morning to you. Good morning. Thanks for coming. Oh, it's our pleasure. Now, this has just been fascinating. You have a connection to Door County. Let's start with that. Yeah, well, our name in uh, number one, Death's mm -hmm. Door, people always want to know where our name comes from. Uh, Death's Door is a passage of water between Washington Island and the Door Peninsula. And uh, since 2005, we've been working with the farmers on Washington Island to uh, grow hard red winter wheat. And it was in 2007 that uh, we decided to start distilling uh, uh, spirits using the, uh, the wheat grown on the island uh, along with malted barley uh, from Chilton, Wisconsin. And so all of it will end up here eventually. What are you going to be making in your still? Yeah, we'll be making our uh, line of products um, that we do now, our mm -hmm. vodka, um, our gin, and uh, Death Store White Whiskey. Um, and then we'll be uh, adding aged whiskey as well. Um, but it won't be ready um, for three years. So uh, we'll be putting that away and actually storing it up on Washington Island in barrels, um, uh, letting it age in the, in the maritime climate up there. And so let's talk about a little bit about the process. We start with the wheat mm -hmm. and then we go through fermentation. Yeah, so we basically take a, wheat, a mixture of wheat and barley mm -hmm. and we make it into mash and then that mash goes into the fermentation tanks where yeast is added. Um, the yeast love to eat the sugars and uh, they excrete alcohol. And then uh, when it ends up being about 8% alcohol by volume in the fermentation tanks, then we move it over to the stills where um, distilling is a process that uh, uses the differential boiling point between water and alcohol. Mm -hmm. So uh, alcohol boils at 173 degrees whereas water boils at 211. And so using the differential boiling points, we can extract out the alcohol through the still and allow the water to, to condensate and go back down into its original form, um, thus distilling and bringing alcohol um, for so everybody to enjoy. I, now tell us the products that you're making in here. You have gin. Right and vodka. We have gin, vodka, and then a white whiskey. And then you'll be doing a white whiskey. And how long does the process take? Is it different for each product? Yeah, yeah, each product takes a different amount of time. Um, the main thing, the fermentation is what takes the longest amount of time. It takes us about five days in fermentation. Um, the distilling itself then, we have to run, um, we go three times through the still. So the first distillation is just stripping. Mm -hmm. um, just basically takes it from 8% alcohol by volume up to a higher proof, 40, 45 to 50% alcohol. And then the final distillations are actually where we do our cuts which bring out the bet we we try to save the best portions of the alcohol the hearts uh, whereas the heads and the tails um, we just we uh, we discard and it'll all be bottled right here too yes we have a full packaging facility we have an automated bottling line that's coming in that will do 45 to 60 bottles a minute we also have a hand bottling line that allow us to do some more custom bottling work and uh, we're very excited about having everything under one roof and now all of this is sold locally too yep we're actually sold uh, locally um, throughout Wisconsin um, a lot of people don't realize we're in 38 states and three countries Countries wow. as well. So um, we're expanding our distribution and adding five more countries this year as well as potentially being in all 50 states by the end of the year. And to think it all started with wheat from Washington Island and now um, coming to a head all here in Middleton. So the grand opening celebration is coming up on Monday here um, out on Eagle Drive at Death Store Spirits. Come on out and meet Brian and learn a little bit more about distilling. Thanks so much. Oh, you're very welcome. Thanks a lot. I didn't sample anything there because they obviously aren't making anything yet, but it was just a fascinating time. Tim Elliott went with me and learned all about the whole process of distilling. And can I just say, you looked ravishing in that hard hat. Rocking in the hard hat. It was better than the hairnet from the Jelly Belly factory. <laughs> but go on out to um, Death's Door tomorrow is their big grand opening. Yep. And then after that, Brian said they'll be offering um, some tours that you plan ahead and explaining the whole process. They even have a complete lab. Their distiller um, majored in that in food sciences and okay. they have a complete scientific lab because I didn't realize this. Um, quality control for distilling is all in the olfactory senses. So you have to be able to smell and they'll explain all that to you as you're tasting too. I think I would need some more explanation behind that. Yeah, okay. but I will definitely enjoy going back to uh, learn a little bit more. Sure, learn a little bit more.